And with that said, we're on our second speaker. Robbie Slaughter has been a supporter and advocate from Sparks for the very beginning, and he has had the opportunity to present on the stage here many times. He runs Accelwork, a company that provides speakers and presenters. Tonight, he is jumping in at the last minute because a presenter dropped out, which you should all be listening to. Please, Sparks needs presenters. So please contact us, Robbie or I, or through the website. Now, just in time for tonight, please help me welcome Robbie Slaughter to the Spark stage. Well, tonight I'm supposed to talk about hookups, about connections, about people meeting each other, about people doing things, and I don't really have a lot to say on this topic because I'm doing it at the last minute, but what I do have is a whole bunch of slides of a bunch of people, of duos, of trios, of small groups that you know. Because when people get together, they can do more than they could on their own. Whether they're doing it in a distant galaxy far, far away, whether they're doing it on 90 television, whether they're doing it in a way that makes no sense except to their fans, or whether they're singing songs that annoy almost everyone except the people who love them. Whether they're changing the world from someone in the front of the house and someone in the back of the house, whether they're singing songs that inspire and incredibly motivate people, or songs that help to change our destiny, or simply songs that we enjoy singing late at night. Perhaps these are people that get together because someone created them in their mind, they put them on paper, and they become part of our story. Or perhaps they're people who, as a team, are at the very foundation of our history and identity. Perhaps people who understand, through their own discoveries, the fundamental nature of who we are. But not just in telling the truth through discovery, but also through deception. Perhaps it's about people who are getting together to make us laugh, people who are getting together to defend our honor, or perhaps people who are getting together to take other people's honor and belongings away. Sometimes those who hook up, those who get together, are really just there to look cool and have fun. Or perhaps they're there to create new inventions that change the course of our world or change the course of the game. And sometimes the groups that hook up do things that make really no sense to probably anyone in this room except for their children. And of course, sometimes the teams that work together are teams of people that are doing what's right for them in the moment and right for the universe in which they live. Whether that universe is fictional or a universe that changes the world, enemies can become friends and friends can become enemies again, even if they're protecting the world to keep it safe for democracy or simply to blow lots of things up. Whether people are hooking up to destroy or to create, oftentimes they're hooking up for the purpose of art. And whether that art is meaningful or powerful or just about shooting things in the sky, people are making things happen. People are inventing, they're creating, they're producing, they're making us think, they're making us sing, they're making us dance, they're making us laugh. They're making us do all kinds of amazing tricks and experiences and adventures, sending us on journeys that may be powerful and important for who we are. And we all laugh and cry and think and experience these journeys through these hookups that exist in this world. And I know that when you see each of these images, there's a hookup of your own. It brings back a sense of identity, a sense of purpose, a sense of a story of your own life. Because each of these hookups, as they happened, are part of a hookup of your story. You remember the time when you saw these two gentlemen hooking up for an unlikely adventure over and over again. Or perhaps these two guys creating some crazy invention. And even if you don't know their names, hookups have also changed the course of history. That each individual, through their own collective conversation, made things happen. Whether they were there to laugh, to create, or simply to feed us delicious ice cream. And we sing, we think, we poke and prod at each other. We're roommates, we're friends, we're creators, we're troublemakers, we're, we're people who are making things happen constantly in our lives, even if that's a dangerous thing. And so I'm happy that hookups happen, and I'm really happy that this one occurred. Thank you. You got me. Wow, he got me.
Don't delay. Get your ticket for the next Sparks event today.